is curious about your choice this time. Wherever the tides may take us, you will bear witness to our fight. Government must be guided by virtue. Chi, do you keep this in mind? Yes. Virtue must come first. Politics, commerce, it all must serve the people. From now on, you shall be known as Jinshi, bearing Jinja's name as your own. What do you think of this world? Like... here. Darkness clings, the lights flicker in the gloom. A guiding light in the field. That's why they stand out so brightly against the darkness. to one Sonoro Spear. Magistrate Jinchi, one shall await you there. Rover, this battle is related to the fate of Jinjo, and only you can open this Sonoro Spear. The key to Jinjo's future lies in your hands. If I open it, Jinshi is bound to face you in the ultimate battle. The ideal outcome would be for her to absorb your power at the critical moment and restore the time flow without any loss of life. But there's a chance that she could push herself too far and end up dying from overclocking. Though, I do nothing. You'll use your remaining power to freeze all of Jinjo in time. Hurry. Right. Now, please let us know your choice. Rover. I have been preparing for this moment. Leaving Jinjo behind fills me with regret. Knowing I may never again bask in its glorious sunshine, or witness the purity of its snowflakes. But that's why I'm here. To ensure that others can still experience the wonders of nature. Our city has a rich history, with generations witnessing endless sunrises and sunsets at the border. Our people have sacrificed their blood and tears to protect Huanglong's safety. They deserve a bright future. I want to protect Jinjo in my own way. As Jinshi, as a citizen of Jinjo, and as Jinjo's magistrate. Let's begin.
away. Be swift. to become a candle of light. But I still want to try. I want to see if I can ignite a spark of hope for Jinjo.
G Arbiter. Huh. May this one transfer the temporal mandate to Jinshi. This one has heard your decision. the way. 